Pacers hosting the Sixers, and the Sixers are four and a half point road favorites. The over under is at 237 and a half. The Sixers are minus 205 on the money line, and the Pacers are plus 172. Now, these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to tip off tomorrow. Thank you to everyone who has joined my Discord and who continues to join it. If you've not done so yet, you can do so by visiting my website or clicking on the membership link in any one of my social media profiles. It is a paid membership, but it will give you access to my best bets, my stats, the games that I bet on, college basketballs in there exclusively. It's supposed to be Maxi, Obrey, Batum, Harris, and Embiid, then Nemhard, Heald, Nismith, Siakam, and Turner. Lineups have not been confirmed. That's just who's supposed to be there. They played each other twice this year and split. The Sixers won the first game 137-126. And the Pacers won the second one, 132-126. Both of those games were in Philly. Head-to-head, -head, the Sixers are 7-3. and three. The home team is 6-4. and four. The favorite is 8-2 and two on the money line. The underdog is 6-4 and four against the spread. The over is hitting their last five games. The over is 8-2. And, and the over 237.5 is 7-3. The Sixers are on a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6-game winning streak. There was a total of 247-233. Then 186 points and then 256 points. They beat the Nuggets by 5, beat the Magic by 15, then beat the Hornets by 8, and then beat the Spurs by 10. For the Pacers, they are on a three-game losing streak. They are 4-6 and six overall, 4-3-3 four, three and three against the spread, and the under is 8-2. and two. It just depends on what you got the Nuggets at in that game because the Nuggets opened up at three and a half and then they closed at five. So it, that's borderline there. There was a total of 247, 233, 227, and then 223. They beat the Kings by five, then lost by three to the Blazers, lost by seven to the Suns, and then lost by five to the Nuggets. This is a, an interesting kind of game, but I do think that the Sixers are a better team. I think the Sixers win this game, even though they're not the greatest on the road. I'll take the Sixers with the money line. I'll take the Sixers laying the points, and I'll go over. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.